Now, if you're looking for an award-worthy meal that won't break the bank, NYC food guy Lawrence Weidman takes us on a food adventure to a Thai restaurant in Elmhurst, Queens. You haven't really eaten Thai food in New York until you've been to the best neighborhood for Southeast Asian food, Elmhurst, Queens. As you can see, I have pretty much died and gone to Thai food heaven. And the mastermind behind all of this glorious food in front of us right now is none other than Chef Kitty. Hi. Thank you so much for having us here. Every time I've been here, it's been memorable, delicious, flavorful, and very unique. Why is Ayada so different from so many of the other Thai restaurants in New York? I never worked from anybody, so this is the way we eat at home with my mom, my family. So it's what a real Thai person would have back in Thailand, and you didn't learn from anyone else, no, just, no. just from your just own mind. my own mind, yes. And I'm happy to see that some of my basics for every authentic Thai meal are here. The kanamu crab, Chinese broccoli sauteed with pork belly, and soy sauce, and chili, and garlic. garlic. Another favorite, the pork lard. Yes. The ground meat salad, famous from Laos. Mm -hmm. I also see a papaya salad with something incredible resting on top of it. What is this? That's the catfish. I mean, last month I went back to Thailand. I see like people crazy about this. Wow. So I'm like, oh, let me come back and I want to do it. All right, well, enough talk. I got to try this thing already, okay? okay? okay. Bon appetit. Thank you. Thank you. Mm, wow. Beautiful papaya salad. A little catfish. Mm -hmm. Wow. Oh my god, but it's not fishy. No, it's not. What is this beautiful dish right here? That's the raw shrimp salad. That's what my favorite dish. When I drink or I eat by myself, I like to... Really? Yes. By creating lime and alcohol and raw and shrimp yes. is a perfect combination. You will be fine. So you might fall asleep, you know, because <laughs> yes. you drank too much, but you know. Okay, if you don't mind. Spice is a very controversial topic in Thai food mm -hmm. because there's a lot of people out there who look like me who go into Thai restaurants and say, I want Thai spicy. No. And what is Thai spicy if someone comes in and asks for it? If 20, 30 of the small chili. They're going to get 20 Chip. to 30 yes. of these of this, chilies of this. in one dish? Yes. Has mm -hmm. anybody exploded yeah. or just it, it it like spontaneously the, burst into flames? Under the ear, everything like, oh my God. <laughs> I said, don't ask for the Thai spicy. <laughs> if you ask, you, you will get it. There is one dish that you make that is not on the menu mm -hmm. and it's only served oh. Sundays and Saturdays from okay. 11 a.m. until it's sold out at 1 p.m. Yes. And yes. it is the fried, fried banana. banana. This is the best day of my eating life. So this is a beautiful sweet plantain. Yes. Wrapped in a beautiful batter with sesame seeds studded in it. I mean, why am I talking? Cheers. Cheers. Oh my God. Where did you get the recipe from? My mom. When was the first time you learned to make it? 10 years ago. My real recipe, I mean, this is Ayara. This no, is Ayara. No, Ayara. It's my signature. I'm proud to say that. This is mine. You should be proud yes. to say it because these are incredible. <laughs> Chef Kitty, one more cheers. 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 Thank you so Thank much you. for having me. Thank you. See you guys down here too.